கேஸ் ஸ்டடி ஏர் பொல்யூஷன் பை பிரிண்ட் ஸ்ட்ரை கிரேட் ஃபைவ் பி ஐபி பி ஒய்பி Distinguished ozone levels are linked to advances in hospitalizations, emergency room visits and premature death because of a polluted air and heavy radiation from sun. Both pollutants cause environmental damage. Every day, the air we breathe can reduce life expectancy by 2 to 3 years. and an estimated total number of 6.3 million deaths caused by air pollution air pollution has been going on for years and takes many forms it is harming our environment and killing us slowly to solve this problem the people of the world need to start trying to make an everyday effort and have the governments of the world set reforms in line to combat air pollution graph on sources of emission of air pollutants industry 52% transportation 27% consumer and commercial products 8% commercial and residential heating 1% agriculture 10% and others are 2% This is statement on air pollution. Air pollution should be brought under control by legislation and by citizen actions. The combination of legislative action and citizen action has proven effective in other social problems. The success of grassroots work is well documented and legislation provides checkpoints for industry compliance. This is statement 2. Most air pollution is man-made and derives from poor eruption of fossil or biomass fuels. There are also natural indoor air pollutants like radon and chemical pollutants from building materials and cleaning products that also impact the health. air pollution alternatives the most basic solution for air pollution is to move away from fossil fuels replacing them with alternative energies like solar wind and hydro power producing clean energy is crucial but the important is to reduce our consumption of energy by adopting responsible habits and using more efficient devices alternatives for fossil fuels there are three alternatives for fossil fuels one is solar and another is wind and the last is hydro there are lot of advantages for this but there are some reasons for why people not use it alternative 1 solar energy we all know that solar panels does not emit any type of greenhouse gases to the ozone but people don't use it because the cost of the solar energy for solar plant the initial cost of purchasing a solar energy is fairly high This includes paying for the solar panels, inverter, batteries, wiring and installation. The second reason is weather dependent. Although solar energy can still be collected through summer and spring, 
the efficiency of the solar energy drops in winter alternative 2 wind energy wind energy is also a natural and renewable resource to produce electricity they don't emit any greenhouse gases to the ozone even though people don't use it there are six reasons for why people don't use it first reason The wind is inconstant. Reason 2. Wind turbines involve high upfront capital investment. In short words, they are costly. Reason 3. Wind turbines have visual impact which may reduce the local bird population. Reason 4. Wind turbines cause noise disturbances. Installation can take up significant portion of land. This is the reason why. And the last one is, wind turbines can be a safety hazard because sometimes they may get fired because of some technical issues inside the turbine. alternative 3 hydropower there are seven reasons why people don't use hydropower reason 1 energy impact on fish reason 2 to create a plant a running water source must be dammed reason 3 limited plant location while hydropower is renewable There are limited places in the world that are suitable for plant construction. Reason 4. Higher initial cost. Reason 5. Sensitive to droughts. Reason 6. Flood risk. Reason 7. Methane emission. While obviously not polluting as coal plants, hydropower do generate the greenhouse gas methane. proposed solution solar energy i recommend solar energy because processing solar energy does not release carbon emission unlike coal which many utilities use to produce electricity by using solar energy to power our home greenhouse gas emission from electricity could decrease considerably When exposed to direct sunlight a typical home solar panel produces about 300 watts in 1 hour which means that in a normal day during summer it can produce around 3 kilowatts per hour of energy solar energy is a renewable source of energy that is gaining ground because of the benefit it offers Thank you.